Yo, what is going on guys? Back in another video. So for today's video, we have something really special planned out. We're unboxing three different mystery boxes and each one is worth $500. So first up for this video, we're gonna start with the smallest box. All of them are the same price, $500. Rip my bank account, but this one is starting out at 11 pounds. And the next one, we have a 18 pound box. And then the last finale box, we have a 22 pound box. The more weight usually means more prizes. So obviously each box is gonna get cooler in the video. So I hope you guys watch till the end and check out all of the stuff we get in the last box. All right guys, let's jump into our first box. So obviously at the end of this video, like always, I'm gonna be shooting all of the guns for you guys so you guys can see them in action. So that will be at the end of the video. Let's jump into this first box. I'm actually curious how much, cause this is okay, 500 bucks for a single box. I mean, that's a lot of, that's a lot of money, right? I'm curious what they'll actually pack in this guy. It might be an SMG, it might be a pistol. So I'm really curious to see what this is. The last time we did this unboxing, um, there's a whole bunch of accessories and stuff along with it. So let's see what we got. All right, so first up, we got a X1000 uh, goggle set. I guess it retails for $80. So unbox it and see what we got. By the way guys, um, every single item I'm gonna be getting in this unboxing, um, I don't even know what I'm getting obviously, but I'm gonna be giving it all away to the uh, Airsoft Club members. So this is my club, it's called the airsoftclub.com. The website is the first link in the description below. Um, I give away airsoft guns every single week on the club. I also have a Discord. I also have private videos that are not on YouTube and we also have percents off my other store. So when I do patch drops and have other products on there, eventually you'll get percents off of that. And again, I give away an airsoft gun every single week on that site to the club members. So it's super fun. We give away guns every single Friday. We all get in the discord and have a blast together on those Friday nights. Um, I really recommend it. And obviously if you do not want to join the club, watching these videos is obviously enough support for me. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching these videos, but moving on. So this is the actual goggles itself so we got some kind of vents down here and obviously the goggle protector you can put on there so you don't have to you know scratch the lens and stuff so without further ado we're going to put these away and move on to the next item all right so next up we actually have a it looks like a lancer tactical maybe red dot site or something i'm not really sure and it's 50 bucks it looks like for retail let's see exactly what it looks like i'm curious what this guy looks like we did get some lancer tactical red dots in our previous giveaway or sorry, our previous unboxing, but I'm curious what this looks like. Okay, so it looks to be a tan little reflex sight. Uh, pretty cool. So obviously uh, with that sticker, it said that you can actually change the reticle and the color of the reticle. So obviously you can have a green dot and a red dot. And then I think somehow, I could be wrong, but I think you can actually change the, oh yeah. So down here, if you guys see that, I'll zoom in for you guys, but you can actually change the actual reticle itself. You can change them down there, pretty cool. And then you obviously have the different color and stuff too. And by the way, guys, uh, if you are going to be the winner of this particular gun, whatever is in here, uh, you do get obviously all of the attachments, you know, the red dot sights, all the stuff you get in the box uh, with the gun as well. So just kind of bonus stuff for you guys. Let's see what else we got. We got a, looks like a AK speed loader. Okay, so maybe this is a AK in here. We'll have to see. So we also got a Hera Arms front grip. Uh, pretty cool. It looks like it goes onto a rail system, which is pretty cool. Just like a front grip. Uh, this is super nice. I really like the packaging. It's kind of interesting. Never really see them in like a plastic box. It's kind of weird. So let's unbox this for you guys. Looks like you just pull it out and then here it is. So it looks like it's some kind of, I would guess OD green is the color or some kind of tan. Um, I'm a little color deficient, so I really don't know, but I think it's maybe OD green, but it could be tan. I really have no idea, <laughs> but this is looks to be on a rail system and is a little front grip. Pretty cool. Looks like we also got real quick a lens protectors, which is always very nice. When you get a very nice red dot like this, you definitely want to get one of these. Um, obviously it, it is uh, a little expensive for like a piece of plastic on a rail, but this, trust me, will save your red dot. So always get one of these if you can. So last thing we got in this box looks like a flashlight super ion, I guess it's called ASG super ion flashlight. I think that's how I pronounce it. Uh, 30 bucks. So it's pretty cool. Let's check her out. So whoever gets this one in my club will definitely be able to customize this. You'll have a full red dot sight. You'll have a grip. You'll have a flashlight. I mean, this is pretty much a full setup gun, which is really cool. Obviously it's 30 bucks, so it's not crazy quality. It is plastic, but I do like the presentation with the box. It's pretty cool. Without further ado, let's see what we got. Boom. Oh, wow. Okay. That was definitely not what I expected. <laughs> okay. So. We got a Scorpion CZ Evo 3A1. Okay, so in the previous unboxing, we actually have the similar gun to this, but it is the carbine version. So in this one, it looks like we actually got the CQB version, pretty cool. And we also got it tan. I think previously we have a black one, which obviously is going to be given away to club members as well. 
So if you like Evos, this is a good uh, giveaway batch to sign up with because we got lots of Evos this time. But obviously you got this really nice uh, kind of owner's manual, like really nice pictures, kind of all the different years of the guns. Uh, I do really like how they uh, made this, how ASG did that. Obviously it is the uh, tan one, which is kind of unique. I haven't really actually seen one of these in tan, which is cool. Um, it has that really cool MOSFET that sounds like a Sistema PTW. Um, I'll be obviously shooting this in the end and you guys will be able to tell what I'm talking about. But it has safety, a uh, semi-automatic, and has really cool three-round burst. That's really neat. Obviously, I'm going to shoot this gun and be really excited because this thing shoots really cool for being a stock gun. So this is obviously something really cool to get. It's also got a full folding stock, which is really nice as well, and a little bolt catch as well. Pretty cool. And you can actually see the inside of the gearbox, and I think this is the dial to turn up the hop, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, pretty cool. And this is the magazine as well. Pretty nice. All right, all right, all right. So moving on to the second $500 mystery box. This is a long boy, as you can see. Uh, this is the 18 pound one. I have no idea what's in this, obviously. Um, this one does feel kind of like more compact. Whereas this one doesn't feel as compact, but it's definitely more dense. And there's a weird crest with this that like maybe there's like a gun right here and like a gun right here. I really have no idea. Uh, I don't even know what side to start with. Oh, uh, let's do this side. Sure. <laughs> All right, pretty easy enough. All right, first thing we got was a patch, pretty cool, from Lancer Tactical. It looks like we got a um, very long, maybe scope or something. I'm not really sure. Let's see. Um, I'm not sure. It doesn't really tell you on the side. I'm guessing it's a scope because of how long it is, or it's one of those like red dot scopes that are pretty cool. But let's check it out and see what we got. I haven't actually, if this is what I think it is, I actually haven't had one of these before. Um, if it's like one of those red dot sight scopes, I'm kind of kind of down to see what that looks like, but let's see what we got. So this looks like to be like maybe batteries or parts for the sight. I'm not really sure. So, okay, so this looks like to be for a sniper, I'm guessing. Let's see what it looks like. This looks to be more like a sniper scope, but I'm not sure if it's one of those red dot ones like I was saying before, but let's check it out. Um, cool, okay. Okay, so it is a sniper scope, but you guys can kind of get an idea of that. It's just the regular kind of cross sniper scope, pretty cool. I'm actually very curious now because of this, I wonder if we got a sniper in here. But like the last box, that AK mag definitely threw me off, so they could just be throwing random stuff in these boxes. So it looks like we have a whole bunch of parts alongside the gun here. So let's see what else we got. I'm not sure what this first item is, let's check it out. Um, I think this might go on like a top of a helmet or something. I really don't know what this is. Interesting, okay. Looks like a bag. Is this a bag? Oh no, it's not a bag. My arm goes straight through it. That would not be a good bag, but I'm not sure what this is. It might be some kind of like head covering or something like that, I would guess. And what else do we get? We got a N-Star uh, Picatinny mount. This might actually give us another clue. Now I'm kind of confused. This particular like rail system kind of works with like a um, MP5 more, which is kind of interesting. Like you kind of put it on top of the rail and then it allows the top of the gun to actually have a Picatinny rail. But also the sniper scope is throwing me off because it would be so weird to pair up a MP5 with a sniper scope. So now I am actually very, very confused. Um, <laughs> I think we all are. So I'm very curious what gun we actually get in this box. So next up, we actually have a battery. This is just a normal uh, 9.6 uh, volt battery. Pretty simple. This is also throwing me off too. I have no idea what we're getting because obviously sniper rifles are not electric most of the time. All right, so one more thing in this box. Let's see what we got. Looks to be a Elite Force .20 gram, which is nice because I'm going to be uh, doing a chrono test with .20s. Um, I won't bore you guys with the chrono test. Um, I know you guys just want to see the gun shooting, but I will put the actual chrono numbers on the screen for you guys. So you guys will actually know the numbers if you are curious on um, what the guns are shooting. But obviously I won't bore you guys with the chrono test. But yeah, so .20 BBs. I would think they would give us some heavier weight BBs if we did get a sniper rifle, but we did get a scope. So I'm I'm just so confused. I just we just need to we just need to see what this gun is at, at this point. All right, so without further ado, let's see what this guy is. All right, of course it is upside down. I won't be able to tell what it is, but you guys ready for this? I'm curious what we're gonna get. Let's flip it around and see what we got. Boom. All right. It is a flip it around again. Boop. All right. Classic army something. Electric gun, okay, it's a classic army. It's a, it's an AG maybe or electric or something, but let's see what we got. I'm very very curious what is in here Whoop. Boom, oh Okay, this makes more sense <laughs> So this thing is pretty cool So this is kind of like I guess all of my questions have been answered with this because what we got with this Okay, so it looks like Obviously, uh, this battery does go with this gun and it'll work. Um, and then 
The uh, Obviously this is a MP5 style kind of receiver on the top. So this rail system will actually be able to fit on the top and allow for a sight to be on the top. And then obviously this is kind of a more of a DMR style gun. And that's why the sniper scope was included. Okay, that was very confusing. I was, I was definitely getting thrown for a curveball there. I had no idea what we were gonna get. But now it makes a lot of sense. But this thing looks really cool. I've actually never had a gun like this. Um, really cool. And you actually have a built-in bipod, which is unique. I've never really seen that on many guns, but that's really cool. So it's basically a DMR, really nice. Uh, man, I've never really seen too many of these, even on the field, like I never really see these. And obviously you have the actual DMR, like magazine style. It's not like the M4 one. So this is like a proper DMR, pretty cool. Am I putting that in wrong? Oh, it's actually backwards, that's interesting. So the like feeding lip for the mag is actually on the back side rather than the front side, like M4s and AKs go. So it's got a safety feature and then there's an E, which I have no idea what that means. And then there's there's fire at the bottom there. So I'm not sure what E is, but we'll find out, out with the shooting test and I'll let you guys know at the end of the video. All right, guys, so this is going to be the final box of taste video, the $500 final box of taste video. I hope you guys enjoyed the last two. This is a 22 pound box. So obviously there's a lot of beans in this bad boy. Let's see what we got. Obviously we can put away our knife. Um, this was already kind of, I guess, uh, untaped during shipping. I guess something went wrong and it broke. Um, hopefully nothing actually like, you know, went outside the box and fell out. First up, we actually got something kind of interesting. I guess I could see it right here. Whoa, okay, what the heck? Weird. Okay, so the first thing we got, I really don't know what this is. Okay, so it's a CO2 airsoft pistol, but it has 12 ejectable cartridges. So basically, I don't think for this particular thing, they actually don't shoot out, but I believe the actual like cartridges themselves, you can take out and use whenever you want, but there you go. Okay, so this is the pistol itself from Elite Force. Really, really unique. I've never really seen anything like this. I have seen like Magnum style with the ejectable shells, but this thing is definitely different. I've never seen one like this particularly, like the backside is very more curved and this has a little kind of weird thing I've never really seen. But yeah, just like the silver, it just looks more unique than I've ever seen a airsoft pistol go. And I think this is like something really unique that we just got. I'm not really sure. Off the look up, I'm not really sure what the price is. I'll put that on the screen right now. So basically, to make this simple, you turn off the safety, you put it in the place so this can actually knock it out. You take this out, and the next up, you get this little tab, you pull it out, and you push it to the back. It's kind of like a spring-loaded thing, and then the cartridge actually flies out like so, and then you can go to the next one like so, and then you press this back again, and then it goes out like so, and then out like so, and you guys get the idea, pretty cool. And then obviously when you load them up and lock it in, you actually have this mechanism to actually turn it onto the next one and shoot it like so, pretty cool. All right, next up, we have a tactical airsoft lubricants. Uh, this has got airsoft lubricant, airsoft gel, and gearbox crease. So this is obviously something you need for, you know, maintaining a gearbox or a gas pullback gun, I guess. So we got a, like some dog tags that say airsoft and then player on it um, from gun tag, pretty cool. And then we also have a patch that says, I'm your huckleberry, which is uh, great for this style of package. We also have another patch, I guess, from gun tag as well. Um, we'll pair that up right there, pretty cool. All right, so next up we have a, looks like some kind of maybe, yeah, it looks like a chest rig, uh, pretty cool. Oh no, I was, okay, I'm way wrong. It is a drop like holster. So you can obviously, I guess, pair this up with your belt, I believe, or this is a belt itself, I'm not 100% sure. And you kind of just put this on the side of your hip along with these extra, like, I guess these are extra magazine holders. So that's maybe something we'll be getting at the end of this box, but I'm pretty curious what we'll be getting next. All right, so we got a kind of like tactical neck wraps, wherever you want to call them from uh, Lancer Tactical. I've never really seen it in this pattern, actually kind of unique and uh, pretty cool. But yeah, so moving on to the next thing. And we also got a Strike Systems Tactical Gear ASG... Um, oh, it's a lower mesh mask. Okay, so you're obviously gonna need one of these bad boys if you're playing airsoft. Unless you are crazy and like to play without one of these protectors um, and like to get your tee shot out, but otherwise, very much recommend one of these guys. Okay, this box has a lot of stuff. All right, so we also got a, okay, so CO2 care kit. Okay, that's interesting. These look to be gold. Okay, I've never seen CO2 gold cartridges. That's kind of cool. And then there's like a random, then there's like a random silver one. I don't know why that's in there, but it's kind of random. We also got, looks to be a like laser, possibly. Let's see what we got. 
basically with this you kind of just strap it on with this little attachment right there onto your, your rail and then you have a little pressure switch you can press to turn on the laser and turn off which is really nice so pretty cool addition to the uh stuff we've got already and then we also got it looks like a, a lancer tactical uh triple m4 stack kind of things so you basically just open that up and you can put whatever you know ak m4 or whatever magazine will fit in there so with that i am actually curious now if we are going to get some kind of m4 in here or if we're going to kind of you know match this western style of the previous uh, pistol we got so i'm very curious to see what we got in here next up it looks like we got some bbs so these are open blaster 0.25s this box keeps on giving we keep having a lot of stuff in here all right next up we have a blackhawk strike modular assault systems molly systems a lot of words but this basically looks like to be a uh i think it's like a pistol pouch um obviously it is a goes on like molly like any other kind of like similar style as this you just kind of weave it into your vest or your uh, belt but obviously this looks to be a little pistol pouch so pretty cool all right last but not least before the actual gun itself we have a looks like to be a full vest but this thing's pretty cool i think pretty simple vest um and obviously we got some cool stuff with it that will pair up nicely with the vest perfect color matching which is really nice um and yeah whoever wins this package will get you know everything you need to maintain the gun you know a whole bunch of accessories you know a vest you got magazine pouches you can put some patches on the front right here or i guess the back as well so pretty cool but without further ado guys let's move on to the final gun boom so last but not least this is our final gun this is okay this is really cool i was expecting to get this so it is a legend saddle rifle so this is a super cool combo it is the same company that makes both of them um, that does give me a feeling that you're able to use these same cartridges in each and uh the rifle and the pistol and you can kind of interchange them they both are powered by co2 so that's nice as well and they do have similar kind of you know coloring going on with the kind of black uh, as, as the main color so really cool um they're both okay this one is a ejecting cartridges one so this one actually ejects them this one is kind of more of a push out spring one which is kind of interesting but this one actually ejects them so i'm really really curious to see what this looks like um and you guys will see this in a second but let's open this up and see what we got sweet all right this thing is i have never been i've never wanted to shoot a gun more than this guy this is sweet okay so obviously you have enough cartridges. I think there's maybe, I would guess 20 right there. Yeah, it looks like, where did I see that? Yeah, 20, okay, so you got 20 of those bad boys. If you do play with this, I do think you're gonna lose some of these, but hopefully not. But that's the one thing you do have to worry about. If it is a ejecting gun, you're gonna have to be running after your cartridges the whole game. But let's see what this thing looks like. Um, I'm not sure if this is real wood. I don't think it is, I think it's plastic, but it does look pretty real, it's pretty cool. Uh, the gun itself seems to be metal like the um, actual you know body of it and the actual you know barrel itself they all seem to be metal but i think these little parts are plastic uh, not a big deal but it does look uh, real so that's pretty cool so safety is back here let's see what it looks like So I hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing segment of this video. Now we're going to go on to the shooting part where I'm going to do the chronograph and actually measure the FPS of all the guns and shoot them as well so you guys can see what visually um, and obviously how they sound as well. So let's go on to the shooting range test.
And if you guys do want a chance to actually win any of those guns I did unbox today, along with all the accessories and attachments that did come with the box itself, um, I'm going to be giving away one of those every single week on my club. It is the first link in the description below. It's called the airsoftclub.com. You get an exclusive airsoft club patch along with two stickers for signing up. And you also get exclusive videos from me that are not on YouTube, as well as an exclusive Discord chat. And you get percents off my other store when I do patch shops and have other accessories on my store soon. But if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications. I'll see you guys in the next one.